Hey guys, it's Dave with iParent.tv and today we're going to be talking about the uh, Mac iOS. If you have a Pulse, chances are you've seen the Apple iPhone, iPod, or iPad. And quite possibly, you have all three. And if you've seen any of those things, you probably exactly know what we're talking about, the iOS operating system. It's what makes these devices look cool and it's really the lifeblood and DNA of Apple's mobile products. Apple's mission with iOS was to be super, super minimal. Basically, they've created a device that's so intuitive, you can put it in anyone's hands and they'll be able to use it right from the get-go. Apple's security and privacy settings are second to none and keep even the less experienced safe and secure. From passcodes to find my phone, Apple has their users pretty well covered. Hands down, the most impressive aspect of their security is their parental controls. You can restrict access to the internet, to the camera, to the app store, and the in-app purchases. Simply jump into your settings, click General, then click Restrictions, then click Enable Restrictions, and go down the list and decide which ones you want for your kids available. You know, from Facebook to Tumblr, from Angry Birds to Heyday, your kids will be faced with some serious decisions. While Angry Birds could be harmless, it could take your kids 30 seconds to destroy their reputation on Snapchat. With social media becoming the only active source of communication amongst teens like Snapchat, you know, it's really, really important that you teach your kid how to use this the right way and you set it up for them the right way. App developers have rapidly targeted the largest growing market in the world. It's your kids. Free games that all your friends are playing and they have riddled ads all over the place and harvesting your personal information, you gotta watch out for all that stuff. So as a parent, really take the lead on this. Giving your kids one of these devices could not only be a bad thing if you don't put in the work early, but it could be a really, really bad thing if they get around your parental controls and guess your password. So make sure you set it up the right way with a good password. We really think that iOS is really great. They've done a great job of making a minimalistic approach to technology. But make sure you keep your family safe. Uh, do it right from the start, right out of the gate. Password, lock them down. And make sure that you choose a good password, not one that your kid will guess later. Thanks guys. Again, this is Dave with iParent.tv. Thanks a lot.